This glass of water represents your life. It's pure, it's valuable, it can be used to nurture everything around you, including yourself. The longer you're with a narcissist, you hear things about yourself like this dirt going into the water. You're terrible, you're the one who's gaslighting, you're stupid, you can't do anything without me, you're not valuable, and slowly that dirt fills up this water. Can't even tell what's water and what isn't. Now we have muddy water, no one would ever drink this. And unfortunately, most of us try to scoop out the bad stuff. We try to get rid of the dirt out of our lives. We try to tell ourselves to ignore that comment. That's not true. We try to convince ourselves that the things the narcissist is putting inside of us isn't the case. But what happens as I'm trying to scoop out the negative things? I'm also taking out what? The good things, right? Most of us dealing with the narcissist fail to realize that the way to get rid of the bad stuff is to actually pour in more of the good to force out all of the negative things that the narcissist has ever said about us by getting into a new environment, by allowing ourselves to get cleaned and transformed so that we can have a different life. Unlike the first way of focusing on the narcissist and what the narcissist is doing and trying to counteract everything that the narcissist does, when I focus on myself, when I fill up myself with the things that are good, when I make my life the way that I want it to end up, with a clean glass of water again. If you're focusing on the wrong thing, you will continue to get more of the thing that you don't want while also polluting the thing that you do want. If you're ready to make a change, you wanna be with a community of people who love you, who see you for who you are, who have an actual plan of how to get you through this situation that you're dealing with with the narcissist, regardless of what that looks like, then I want you to shoot me the word detox and let's get started.